Hello, welcome to LEV Toys. We have got a new Lego Friends house to build. Now this one is a bit different. This is actually a junior set, which means it's gonna be easy to build, which makes me very happy, which means we can get in and play with it really quickly. And you know what? It's actually called Stephanie's Lakeside Beach House or something like that, Lakeside House. So Stephanie already has a beach house. So her family must love the beach. Two houses now. So we have got three mini dolls and they're all coming in their standard outfits. So this is pretty good value to even start with. We've got Olivia first and she comes with an accessory. So she comes with her bag with a wrench. So, uh, and she's got some sunglasses. So she will be ready to fix things or sabotage things depending upon her frame of mind at the time. And the set also has, I said, three mini dolls, right? So this one is Andrea, of course. And once again, in her new standard outfit for 2018. And she comes with the new headphones too, which are massive, but they at least stay on her head without popping off. She's also got her little beach bag and she's bringing her touch phone. So <laughs> she's all equipped. And of course, it is Stephanie's house, or I don't, actually Stephanie's parents' house, I suppose. Stephanie's house. So of course she has to be included in the set and Stephanie's head the face print I think is the same as it was at the beginning of the year not the slightly revised version that we're now seeing halfway through the year so I suspect that this set was actually planned right back at the beginning of the year I don't know I could be making that up but anyway <laughs> we've now got three minifigures and a cool easy house to build but before we do that of course there are going to be extra parts so this is bizarre why are we putting together a trophy display here we've got a gold on the top and two silver ones for second and third and what else have we got we've got a wobble board it's a wibbledy wobbledy board the girls can stand on here and they can dance and they can wobble and they can see who tips it over first i'm pretty sure that's not what it's actually for so they need to hop off <laughs> we need to put together uh, one of these little oh it's a little floating boy thing and it's the checkered flag for either the start or the finish. Oh, okay. So this is actually a race set. I thought it was a house. I suppose we'll find out as we keep building. Got a couple more of our little floaty boys with flags so they can mark the path. Oh, which Stephanie is just showing out. They're definitely floating though. So they're in the water. So the girls are actually racing in their own teeny tiny speed boats or jet ski type things. This is like an abbreviated, abbreviated speedboat. No, definitely, I definitely think it's a jet ski. So we've got a blue one here for Stephanie, which is, so she wins. Ta-da! <laughs> She's even doing wheelies. Do you call it wheelies in jet skis? I don't know, because they don't have wheels. <laughs> Seems wrong. And we've got an orangey yellow one, which is obviously the right colors for Andrea. But apart from that, it's exactly the same build as Stephanie's little jet ski. And oh, careful, Andre, you just knocked over Olivia. Olivia's now got her wrench, or kind of, she keeps dropping it. And she's going to fix your jet ski, or maybe fix it so you can't run over anybody anymore with it. But we'll give her her own jet ski too. So she gets a pink one because, once again, right colors for the girl. So let's put... Let's put your wrench in one of, the, one of the trophies and then we'll put Olivia in here. And they've each got their own little vehicle so they can race, but we're not racing yet because we've got more building to do. But I do promise it won't take too long. So we're up to bag number two. Now we get to start on this cute little lakeside house. And they, <laughs> they are just having a marvelous time on those jet skis. All right, the base plate here is nice and easy. It's got these cute little prints on them. There's puppy dog paws going everywhere. I haven't seen a puppy dog yet. Maybe we'll find a dog later. I think obviously it's gonna be Stephanie's dog. And I just love how much fun these junior sets are to play with, even though they're nice and basic, but that, that doesn't make them any less fun. So we've got obviously a sink here and there's a cup on the side and we can put it over here. We can pop it out of the house too, if we want to. Another big pink brick with some see-through bricks on it is going to make, let's see, oh, a Tony thing on the top. It's a television, it's a widescreen television with tennis playing on it. <laughs> so that's going to be the living room and Stephanie is very keen on finding out who is winning at the moment so she's going to watch while we keep building. And over here on the outside there's a massive basketball hoop and as per usual I always have to see whether the girls fit through the basketball hoop and they do. <laughs> that, that just gives me so much, I find that hilarious. And on the outside there's a shower 
And I'm gonna assume that that shower is for rinsing off after being out in the water. There's a ladder going to nowhere at the moment, but I'm sure that won't last. And now we've got a massive big wall piece with two big windows and a door. I love this, this is so fast. This is number 42. And on the other side, we've got some nice greenery. And voila, look at that. The wall is prepared. <laughs> the whole front of the house just appeared like that. Uh, let me in, let us in. There we go, oh, hold on, Stephanie keeps falling over. She can't let anybody in. She's gonna stay inside where she's safe and maybe she won't fall over so much. And while she's standing there, we'll put some more little walls on and then we'll see what happens next. There's so much here, it's so fast. We got some overhang awnings and now we're doing smooth pieces on the top with single little jumper pieces, which means we're gonna be able to pull off the next level of the house and bring it down to floor level if we want to. Okay, uh, here we have got a little tiny jetty that juts out the front so they can park right at the front. They can pull up at the front and we're up to bag number three. Goodness me, I told you this was gonna go fast. Bag number three has got a couple of railings to start with and some things to decorate out here on the front balcony. So a little, a little plant and on this side, a little stool with some juice on it. Oh, this is gonna be so cute and fun. And what else are we putting out the front? We've got something to sit on, obviously, because that's the little foot piece. Oh, it's gonna be like a deck chair for out the front of the house. And you can recline there and drink your juice and watch everybody whiz by on their jet skis while you relax. <laughs> it's a good idea, Olivia, I think so. Oh, and here's the puppy dog bowl with a bone. So I think the dog's not too far away. He is his dash. And there's a pet bed right there behind the dog bowl and a ball. That sits quite snugly there, so that's gonna be for the basketball hoop. Now, what is this red thing? It could be any number of things, but now it can't be any number of things. Now it's definitely a couch, which goes in here. That is so close to the television. That is, right, you, that, you, haven't you heard you're not supposed to sit that close to the television? We might move that couch back, just one stud, and see whether there's a bit more room there. <laughs> there is a bit more room there. Okay, that was a bit too snug in there. <laughs> Needed a bit of modification. And now we might have, it looks like it might be an oven or a stove. Oh no, hold on. It's got green grapes in it. And on top of that, so it's gonna be a little fridge with a fruit blender on the top with some pink, with some cherries and some strawberries so they can make some fruit slushies except I'm a bit concerned by the fact that there is no lid on that. So it is going to be super duper messy when they do make slushies. Now we've got three of these little seats. They're just so cute and they're all matching. And I don't think there's room to put them inside. Let's put the girls on them and see what they're actually for. Oh, oh, this is really cool. They've got a little spot here, which we can put outside. It's a big fire pit. Look at that. And they can toast marshmallows while they're out here sitting around the fire, keeping warm in the evening. And, oh, look at this. Oh, Andrea has even got her guitar so they can have a sing along too, like a campfire sing along. This is awesome. We're up to bag number four. And I think bag number four is going to hold our stuff for the second story. So another room on top. Oh, this is so easy. I'm loving this. So we've got a whole pink floor base here, a whole wall ready done with the vines growing up the side. But oh, look at that sweet little window in the middle with the curtains on it. I do love the fact that I don't have to put any stickers on. <laughs> it makes it all so much easier. Everybody's coming to stand in the windows. <laughs> and we'll put that here on the front of the room. And that's the outside already done. So on the inside, we're gonna need some things to play with. So we've got a chest of drawers there. And next to that, we've got a hook for some reason. And up here on the wall, there's some sporty posters and some postcard things. And that looks as though it's pretty much it for over there. Here's a rod for the hook. And I'm not certain what the rod's for. <laughs> we've got a suitcase, which we're just gonna chuck in here. <laughs> it's nice and tidy. So they're gonna come here on holiday and the rod is actually for all of the life vests and there's even an extra one that's useful. Okay, a nice big crate with a round yellow thing and a pink boomerang. Oh, it's beach toys. Oh, it's toys for Dash. So the yellow thing is a Frisbee. Oh, Dash is right in there. 
Dad, she's very excited. He wants to go straight out on the beach, <laughs> but we can't. We've got to keep building. We've now got some beautiful printed bedspread pieces for Stephanie's bed. Perfect. And this actually sits here facing out. So you can look out the windows. It's kind of a weird position for playing. We might want to turn it around when we're actually playing with it, but that's, that's, she's going to look out at the view and she's got a really nice little lamp and a cup next to the bedside. Next to the bedside? On the bedside. And some awnings too to match the ones downstairs. And I think, oh, we have this piece left over that's not the sort of piece you normally would have left over. It belongs here on this little bench top there. There we go. All right, let's install this on top of the first story of the house. And like I said before, we can actually pop this on and off if we want to play with it in different places. And that's what our ladder's for is to get up to the second story. It's a perfect little doll's house to play in. It's so cool. Oh, this is good. All right. Okay. Well, we're going to play with it, aren't we? So Stephanie has arrived before the other girls. She's waiting patiently. Dash has heard something, though. Dash is, oh, Dash is barking ferociously. Shh, Dash is really noisy. Oh, oh, hold on. Here's Olivia. He must have heard the girls coming. And here's Andrea. He's so excited to see them. All right. <laughs> All right, Stephanie, are you ready to race? Let's bring in your jet ski. And Dash is also going to race, not very safely there on the edge, but you know, he likes to join in everything. Can Stephanie even hold on when Dash is there? I don't know. I suppose we're going to find out. We're going to take her head off and put her life vest on so she is safe. Safety first. And off she goes. They're off. Here we go. Let's have a race because, you know, you can't do anything without competing, apparently, in the Lego Friends world. Okay, here we go. All right, through. Now you're supposed to go through between the boys, not like on top of them. Oh, Andre. <laughs> oh, they've just. I swear they're just aiming for the flags. You're supposed to go between them. Oh, Andre is over. Oh, she's up again though. Okay. That was not a catastrophe at all. I think they all need glasses. Even Olivia with her glasses is not seeing very well where she's going. I think she just came first though. Though I don't know it's, it's a very good competition. <laughs> Andre has just run into everybody. Okay. All right. That's enough racing. Time to go and find out what the score is on the tennis game and everybody can try and snug in here. Does everybody fit? Everybody fits except you're all way too close to the television screen, girls. <laughs> and now it's time to go out and do some more outside stuff. So we'll drop all this stuff down. There we go. Look out down below. Frisbee coming. Now we can go and play on the beach with Dash. Okay. Andre is throwing the Frisbee and go. Go, Dash. Oh, there he goes. Is he going to find it? Oh, here we go. He's bringing it back. Oh, that's cool. All right, Stephanie. Stephanie, would you like a go? Yeah, look, he would love you to throw it again and go. Is he coming back? He's lost it. He can't find it. He really seriously can't find it. Oh, oh hold on. Olivia has a solution. She's probably got a robot or some sort of like remote controlled amazing thing that will find the frisbee or not. Maybe she's just going to get the boomerang. Okay, she just went to get the boomerang. Okay, she's throwing it. Off you go. And nobody told Dash that boomerangs come back. So that was a bit of a trick, Olivia. I don't think Dash is going to appreciate being tricked like that. He wants to know why you're still holding the boomerang. Poor Dash. <laughs> right, he's had enough. He's gone off to find the frisbee. And what are the Lego Friends girls going to do now? Well, as night falls, they're going to toast some marshmallows and have a sing-along near the campfire. And they can turn the TV around and they can keep watching the tennis while they toast their marshmallows. <laughs> and then when it's time for bed, Stephanie has a bed so she can go to sleep. Now, hold on. Does that mean Olivia and Andrea? Oh, they're all good. OK, they can maybe all fit in there. Oh, hold on. Do you think that uh, Andrea can fit in there? I think they're not going to have the best. Oh, Dash. <laughs> right, Dash is in there. They're not going to have the best night's sleep like that. Come on, move over, everybody. That's just ridiculous. <laughs> so if you two snug up there, maybe Olivia could. She's falling off the couch in here and also still too close to the television. It's really loud because it's permanently on. So maybe she could have a sleep. It's a beautiful night. She could sleep out on the deck chair and Dash, you've even got your own little bed over here. So if you want to snuggle down there, everybody's got a comfortable place to sleep for the night. 
see it all worked out perfectly. Now, make sure you have subscribed just so you get notifications when new videos go up. Don't forget that there is now some LEV Toys merchandise. If you would like to wear me on your t-shirt, then hop over to the little link and order yourself a shirt for your birthday and check out some more videos while you wait for a new one. And I'll see you with that one really, really soon. Bye.